Today, the topic of discussion is cursor in SQL. We have already understood what is cursor and we have seen all the theoretical part and syntax of cursor. And today, what we'll do, we'll see the implementation of cursor in Oracle. Let's start. Okay, so there is a syntax called cursor syntax and see what we are trying to do over here. What we are, we have a declaration section and in a declaration section, we are creating a variable known as vname and the data type of that variable is where care and the size of that variable is 10. So in the de declaration section, we have two things. Either we want to create a variable. Yes, we have created a variable and after that, there is a cursor. So we are creating a cursor, cursor and the name of this cursor is imp007. Not, not Whatever name you want to give, you can give any name. Okay, is, then we use, use is, I have already told you, is select what e name from imp what is it this is the this table is m table where e id is less than four so what you are doing actually you are selecting e name you are selecting e name from what m where e id is less than what four so you are looking for these three rows and in this row you are three rows you are looking only for e name okay fine you are only looking for these e names fine okay let's start then so uh, this is what we understood till now. And then we have begin section and begin. We are opening a cursor. Which cursor? Which we have created. Which we have created? Imp007 we have created. We have opened this cursor. And after that we are, you know, uh, taking a loop. Why loop? Because there could be more than one row. And you know cursor, what cursor do? Cursor fetch one row at a time. So if there are three rows, as you clearly see, there are five rows and out of five, three rows satisfy the condition, then it will execute three row one by one. And for execution of one by one row, we need what loop. So we have created a loop over here. And what we are doing is fetch imp not not seven into which v name. What is e name? V name is a variable which we have created here. So what will happen? This will fetch what e name to which v name. This will fetch e name what from imp whose ID is less than four to v name. Okay, then we have exit one in case exit when imp not not seven should is not giving you any value. Exit when m not not seven not found. That is while you are trying to fetch the values and you are not getting a value. The moment it this becomes true, the moment it becomes true, what do you do? You exit. But if I see the current situation, the current situation, the value of John employee ID is less than four. So this becomes what false because we have value. This becomes false. So finally, the first value which we are getting is what John. Why we are printing John? Because in next line, we are printing DVMS underscore output dot put line V name. And what is the V name? John first value fine okay so should we come out of the loop no will not come out the loop unless and until our condition goes false again we go and see Smith Smith employee ID is 2 which is less than 4 yes then we print what we print Smith Smith fine okay should we come out of the loop no we again check the loop are we getting any value which is less than 4 yes Shane employee ID is less than 4 then we what we print we print Shane okay then we try to pick Ricky but what we see that employee ID is not less than 4 so what we are getting it's not found we are getting not found now this condition becomes true this condition becomes true why because now i'm not getting any value which is less than four so exit when you are not getting any value yes i'm not getting value value the moment i exit i come out of the loop and what i am in which line i'm i'm closing what cursor which is what is my cursor imp not not seven so i have closed means i have deallocated the memory and the output we are getting is this john smith and shane and see you can see the output see the output so the output you are getting is what john smith and shane finally fine okay so uh, and this was all the theoretical part so we'll not only discuss the theoretical part what we'll do we'll implement this so let's start and implement this in oracle 10 g let's start okay fine so uh, uh, i have already created this cursor so let me show you this cursor then I've already created this cursor. So no, no need to create this cursor again and again. Okay, so this is the cursor which we have already created. So I've created, I'm just copying it, control C and I'm trying to paste it. Okay, so what I'm doing is I'm pasting this cursor. Okay, so I'm pasting control B. So I've pasted and the moment I paste, I got the value what? Shane, Bob and John. This means the, what I did. See, I have declared V name, same which I told you. The data type of V name is Varker and the size is 10. Then what I'm declaring is name of cursor, cursor and the name of cursor is not, not 7. You can put any value is 
then on select statement we are selecting ename from which imp table where condition is employee id is less than 4 then comes begin and what we do in begin section we open the cursor what in order to allocate the memory fine then we uh, created a loop loop and end loop and between loop and end loop what we are doing we are fetching the values what fetching fetch imp not not 7 into what we name so what we are fetching this imp not not 7 values and what is that value which we are trying to select is what we are fetching e name so what will e name will copy to the v name and exit when you do not find any value currently we are found finding the value then what is the output will print those value which we are there in v name fine and the moment we see that there is no value will come will exit the moment we exit we come to the close loop and we close the we come to the close uh, cursor we close the cursor and we end and then this for execution so finally what we are getting shane bob and john so shane bob and john are three rows three e names whose employee id is less than three you want to check yes let me show you then what we do we write select s e l e c t select star star from what e m p the moment i run this query see shane employee id is two which is less than what three four bob employee id is three which is less than four and then john is what so what we are getting actually we are getting see this three value first is shane c first is shane second is bob and third is john and after that we are getting that procedure successfully completed fine so this is what the output which we are getting so out of these nine values uh, if i'm not wrong nine values one two three four five six seven eight eight values we are getting three values and why this three values because these three values are satisfying the criteria of having employee id less than four finally so at last what i'll say i i, I always say one thing and the thing is